Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to part two of our ecosystem notes. And once again, you don't have to write anything. Just go through this video as I kind of discuss a few um, topics. The one thing I want you to pay attention is you're going to have a quiz after. And that quiz is going to be pretty easy because I'm going to allow you to use the both slideshows. If you remember from the first page of the module to this page, all these questions are on here. All right. So the first one thing is a new word it's called species. Okay. These are organisms that are closely related. We talked about abiotic and biotic factors, for example, like the plants and the giraffes here. Those would be biotic. The rock or rocks, the soil, those would be abiotic. All right. And so all these different types of factors make up uh, ecosystems. This is a particular type of animal. And this, these are giraffes, which is a species. Then these species become larger because they're a population. Like how many of the same species that live in the same place? Um, for example, this year's 2020, they're starting to do a census. If you haven't seen that advertised, because they want to find out the population of how many people live in Muncie, how many people live in Delaware County, how many people live in Indiana and the other 49 states. And then finally, the third word that I wanted to introduce to you is community. And these are all the species that live in an area. And so here you have three different types of animals. As you can see, the giraffe, the zebra, and the wildebeest in the background, they make up this community, as well as all types of plant life, um, water, the sunlight. All these things make up this particular community, and they need each other to survive. Okay? All living and non-living things in an environment, there's your ecosystem. And it's an amazing thing. It really is. So here you see abiotic and biotic factors, and you see these penguins here. They're making up the population of this type of penguin. I'm sure there's other kinds of penguins in this area that make up this community and ecosystem. And here's some plant life. Once again, there's different types of things in this plant life. Some things you can see, some, some things you cannot see. Uh, coral reef here. You have all kinds of different living creatures in this ecosystem that make up this community. And they all live and they thrive and they have to survive uh, with one another. Here is a woodland, woodland area. You see the waterways, which is abiotic. You see the, the green plants, which is biotic, uh, these deer, which are biotic, and they're all making up this ecosystem or this community in this area, including whatever type of wildlife is in that water or what wildlife is up in the mountains. And here you can see two different types of species, wildebeest and zebra running. So here's an example. Species is zebra. Population, zebras, plural. Community, zebras, wildebeest, and plants. All right. So be sure to use this slideshow and the previous one on the first page before you take your quiz. You're not cheating. You're more than welcome to use this and try to help you out. So good luck to you.